Because that's very important to hear that the Queen of England works for the yeah. Rothschild. Yeah. The <laughs> Queen of England works for the Rothschild they family. They command her and they, they hide they their money her. through her because you can't look at her money. Remember, on paper, she's worth like $60 trillion. She owns more property than anyone. It's them. Actually, she's a front for them. She's a front yeah. for them. I'll show you something. Yeah. Makes absolute sense. Yeah. Totally. I totally agree with this and one. And what's that? The prince? I'm going to do my who's, own research. Who's her son? Prince what? He's one of them. Charles. Charles, yeah. He, he, owns, he owns a property in Romania. Let me show Romania. you how you can understand how powerful they are. Who's more powerful? Charles. No, it was the other one. Yeah, Rothschild that's on the right. That's Evelyn de Rothschild. Day from David. Who, Evelyn David him. Rothschild. No, it's just Evelyn de Rothschild. Yeah. And I actually met him and I took pictures of him at the Peninsula Hotel. Here he is, and here's some of the, them here. There he is right there. But he has a son that's mm -hmm. worth. Ten. They inherit. They inherit son, everything. Yeah, they inherit. Because they're so. Rothschilds own the world by 1820. They were, mm -hmm. it's called the age of the Rothschild. But remember, since they control all the media, they don't want people to know. Mm -hmm. By the 1930s or 40s, they decided it's better that no one knows who they are anymore. <laughs> so now they try to close that down so people don't read about it. They don't want anyone to know anymore. It was okay at the time, but now that the world is becoming smaller, they don't want you to know. Oh, I met her. That's because his wife. Because people protest. That's his wife. Mm -hmm. She was at a, he was at the Peninsula Hotel with him. Mm -hmm. Big oh. nose like me. <laughs> Here he is with the queen. You know, big nose Here he women is with are, the queen. are the best in bed. Yeah. Is that true? There you go, yes. I didn't know that. It is. It's number one, the best. Was she big nose? Yes, she was big nose. Oh, she's good in bed. If you go bad, yeah. <laughs> your nose might, well, your nose is the same as hers. Maybe you're good in bed. Here, look at that. Oh, I am She's the got best. a similar I'm nose the to best. you. Yes. No, you know, I mean, I don't believe cute. anybody's 100% evil. Mm. I don't think he's 100% evil. So, and here's the real power. Jacob. But do you think they're Jacob's behind the, the pandemic too? Definitely. Yes. They can snap they their fingers it. and it's over. Of course, they're behind uh -huh. who, who was that, the last one? Well, Jacob, Jacob. is probably the real power. Behind everything, the real money. Yes, he that's could, it. He could Charles, snap his that's where he gets the money. Prince Charles, of dollars to anything. No, Prince Charles has. Oh, yeah, can you please send me that particular picture? Because they're puppets. Because okay. he's buying up Romanian territory like there is no tomorrow. They're buying Charles. the world. They want total control. Yes. Sickening. Can you send me the last yeah. picture with Sickening. Charles? They want complete ownership of the world. And they don't want us to own anything. Yeah. If you don't believe me, you can listen to World Economic Forum. Yes. And listen to Klaus Schwab. Karl Schwab. Klaus. Klaus, Klaus Schwab. Klaus. He wrote the book COVID-19, The Big Reset. Right. And he'll say it. It's never going to return to normal. He's a German. Mm -hmm. It'll never go back to normal. Mm -hmm. And from now on, you will own nothing and you will be happy. That's scary stuff. Oh, very scary. That's who these people are. Oh, that's what we're. That's the war we're in right now. Oh, no. This is what they're... They've been planning this a long time and now there's... They have the technology and they believe because they can Because they got the it. pandemic. They can do it now. Yeah, they needed a war. Mm -hmm. A war would have been easier. Because they have underground cities. You don't even know that, right? Right. There are right. underground cities all over yeah. the world. Yeah. We talked about this. Yeah. I mean, it's incredible. Do you remember when I told you that there is an underground city in Bucharest? There is an underground all over. city in Paris, they in Italy, these in Rome, cities, yeah. everywhere. Yeah, so they can survive a nuclear war. They want a nuclear war. That would have been made it easier for them. <laughs> exactly. But they didn't get it. And if Russia and America were friends, it would be over for them. That's why they had to create conflict between Russia and America. Because if we come together with Russia, it's over. Don't worry, Putin knows who they are. He wants to, he's also one of the good guys. What if I told you that Jing of China is oh, not necessarily oh a bad God. guy? Oh my God, creating the cold, recreating the Cold War is what they want. Yeah, that's, they've done it since the 60s, remember? Go, you know, the nuclear from make Russia the bad guy. No, no, no. It's all fake. Wow. And Russia is not the bad guy. You don't see them expanding, taking over countries, but you see... Satellites. They take over... No, but over you see the, the American the, the military. Satellites. No, you see American military take over countries. But didn't you see what the they Russians are They didn't go in doing? and destroy Iraq. We did. They are... 
They're protecting they are doing debris. Syria. It's a, a, in the cosmos. They are throwing uh, the their they satellites should. are falling apart. They need to apart. be strong. They're on the good side. But is a freaking Putin doing this? I mean, I don't. The totally okay. destroys that they guy. Was a KGB, state. you know? They have the a KGB. Deep state. I know, but this the is security okay. oh I'm telling God. you, it's the freest country in the world right now. No. It was in darkness. He's keeping everybody in darkness. Oh, I disagree. Abs We'll, we'll Putin is keeping to everybody in, no way. in prison, actually. That is Alexander. not true. It's totally free. They're not mandating vaccines I'm going to send you the documentary of what he did to this guy, Alexander, who photographed How his How do you know that that's chateau. not propaganda? It's not. I'm going to send the you the movie. Guys. This is a documentary. Hey, I'm a professor of history. Okay. Well, I'm Come not, on. I'm not it's a documentary. There's no use arguing He about did it. it. He put the guy in prison. He gave him 10 years. Everybody's like watching. Like I said, I mean... You never heard of Alexander Lukashenko? Yes, but I'm but he's one of the oligarchs, right? No, he's not an oligarch. Okay. No, he's an architect. He's in prison right now. He was poisoned in Germany. Yeah. He sent his his uh, okay, minions to okay, poison not, him in Germany. Okay, I'm not. Let's not get into it right now. But I will tell. I will say this: that you don't know who's good and bad sometimes. Wow. And Russia has a deep state as well, just like we have. They're everywhere. No, Putin is a deep state. He's no, he's, a, he he's protected the father Syria. of all, all evil. No, I have to disagree. Did you see he's what they've good. done to women? Putin's they are good. killing and beating up women because I'm I'm sure he, they want he you promoted to the law by if which women have, have to be subservient to men. No, I mean, this is Saudi conflict, Arabia. This how do you is, know that? Afghanistan. This is a Taliban. Putin okay. is a Taliban. Man, listen to me. Oh my God! I've been teaching this for for thirty years. Wait, so you've been believing this for thirty Jesus years? Jesus Christ! Oh my God! But well, look at your history, and you believe that for all these years. Oh my! And it probably was true, and the, and the Russia was. Do you a know how many nation. Romanians died? Twenty million Romanians died because of of the communi communism. I know, in, in but Russia. today is today. Okay. And now they're I not have mandating the book, vaccines. The, the black book of communism. That's I'll give the it to history. You. That's right. <laughs> that is the history. No, so it's reality. It's reality. It's facts. It's statistics. It's Today you're saying it's people, that way. People know. People. I know the families whose people were killed. Grandparents. I'm talking present time now. Right. That's what I'm talking. My present too. time. Yes, exactly. Okay. Present times. The right. descendants of those people who were killed. I met them personally. Who is destroying countries? The security. Who destroyed Libya? The, the Putin. Who destroyed Libya? I don't know Libya, but I know well, my country. Up. No, look Fuck up Libya. Libya. I don't give a damn what about, about Iraq? Libya. Well, who destroyed it? The U.S. military. Did Russia destroy Libya? Bush. Bush destroyed. The yeah. idiot Bush. And who destroyed Did Iraq? The Republican destroyed it. That's right. <laughs> These Republic. It's not Democrat, Republican. The Bushes work for the globalists. It's not Republican versus Democrat. It's not Russia versus America. It's these globalists versus humanity. They're moving the pieces around. You have to go further, and even but these countries. Which, which, which it's hard part to tell of who's globalism? Good and who which, isn't. which part of globalism you think it's evil? Because yes, it has evil, evil aspects, but it has positive aspects too. Well, tell me what the positive aspects are. A globalization no, no, of telecommunications, but, for example, you can send a fax. Okay, why you wouldn't you be able to do that if, without, things, if countries had their own without, sovereignty? You cannot send a fax without the network of. Uh, of uh, of networks of of cables under the ground. Okay, you so but countries facts. can have agreements. Now that and is a that. positive side of globalization. You cannot deny that. But would and, that wait a second? And another would that positive be agreement side. Philanthropy. Between, could not countries, philanthropy is okay, positive. Okay, you're not even letting me talk. Well, because this, I believe uh, there are positive sides to there globalization. There are positive agreements between countries. No, what is the negative side? Rules and what stuff? is the negative facade? People losing their industries, like I Italy. You talk about to China. corporations. You talk about international corporations. I think that's what you. Well, yeah, and I'm talking about that's people negative. losing their that's countries negative. and losing their cultures and losing their own wealth. Like Italy has lost eighty percent of its industry. You know. Look at England. They used to produce engines. Well, they still do, Rolls Royce. But they're some of the best car manufacturers. They lost their industry to China. China is now, we lost our whole economy to China. Where's our economy, America? It's in China. That's globalization. Because it's cheaper to Because do they China. stole all, all our patents. That's why. Because but this they are not global number one. group is The United it. States is number one yeah. still. They stole entire. Apple stores patents and blueprints. 
And well, they rebuilt it there. You what's wrong with globalism? It's criminal. Is you're watching it right on. now. You're watching the entire world be brought into a no, dark no. place. No, no. When you say when you say what's wrong, you cannot say everything is wrong with no, globalism. No, of course that's, not. That's false. Of it's course, completely and, false. But you can't say the opposite. Telecommunications, either. education, philanthropy. That's all positive sides of globalization. Okay, Being well, that's able true about to study. everything. Banking, it's good because what if I go to Romania and and I want to get some money out of the bank? Well, I can't. So those are good things. That's positive. I mean, that's okay. Good. So you can tell me what's good and what's bad. Why don't you positive. answer that? What's good and what's not good? Yes. You answer it. I don't need to answer it. God, tell me what's bad. not good. A super state. You don't want one. International companies are not good because they are not paying people right. And they are not giving retirement and benefits to people. And fire people that are in the streets after working 40, 50 years in, in a company. Like American freaking companies, you know. Like you name it. You name one, you know, Chevron. You, they're all corrupt. And, and they dump their misery in, in Mexico, in Guatemala, in Costa Rica. Yeah, you they can dump tell it. Me you don't need to ask, it's massive. Ask me that. That's we don't negative. Need to argue about it. No, we are not arguing. No, I'm just telling you. That's, no, that's all. But you have to the be clear. Is that it's you not have all black. It's decentralized control systems. It's decentralized. I've written about decentralization. Right. You know I'm not centralized. It. No, I'm on the same page. Power is being devolved to local, local that's mayors, where you want it to be. local uh, councillors. You know, so that's what the devolution okay, is. Okay, America target. was designed on the individual being the most powerful unit. No, well, they are ship and horse. That's right? how the constitution is designed. Right. It starts with the power of the individual, but and that the state not. has no right to take those freedoms and those powers away. away. And then the next yes, power they do. in America, well, they've changed it over a couple hundred years. The next power is the city. The next is the state. The weakest part, according to our constitution, is the Fed. Mm. Okay? They've reversed it now. Now the power is the Fed. But you still see our constitution operating. There are many states in America that won't allow these mandates. Are you an interpretive constitutionalist? No, I'm not skilled in this. You're way more educated than I am. <laughs> I'm just saying from the outside, because of our constitution, there are states now that are able to fight back. Right. and not have these vaccine mandates. Right. But if right. you centralize the power, they can make the command that everyone in the world it's has to be vaccinated. It's becoming Romania and Russia. It's dangerous. That's what Russia is. Yeah, so that's a dangerous part of globalization. Right, right. That's a dangerous. And I do believe that countries should I protect agree. their own industries. Like, I agree. I would like to see Italy should protect its own industry of, of textile. Of course. But they've lost most.